What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading. Have suicide to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, apply everyone. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you and leave the rest. Free general collective reading. Now, this is sign readings. I haven't done them in a while because I received a spiritual download not to do them in a while. But I also received a spiritual download about a month ago saying it's okay as long as I don't make them too long. So, um, I'm going to do them. Um, sign readings for March of 2022. Um, it's very important to only take the messages that resonate. This is for the sign of Leo. Just saying. Um, this could resonate if you have Leo in any aspects of your chart. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Mid, Hammer, Jupiter charts. Um, only take the messages that resonate. Okay. Spirit messages you have with on Leo. Spirit messages. Okay. Too many. Spirit messages you have, San Leo. Two of Wands reversed, Nine of Pentacles upright, the Empress upright. Feminine energy, Leo. Someone in your community really wants to take you out on a date, but they have not made a decision yet. They know some horrible things were done to you in the past. They know you will, you will not take any crap, and you ask a lot of questions. Very narcissistic energy. Earth sign, beware. Oh my God, you plug it in, how it resonates. Wow, okay, well, there you go. So this is for Fem Energy Leo, if this resonates for you. You can have Leo in your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, No, Man, Hammer, Jupiter charts. I feel with JJ Hearts here, because I heard Fem Energy. Um, I heard someone from your community, Earth Sign Energy. So our Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo, masculine, I'm feeling, because they're coming in as the Knight of Pentacles energy, or it could be a Fem that takes on heavy masculine. You plug it in, how it resonates. It's either a masculine, I'm feeling, or... Then that takes on heavy masculine. But however that resonates, I heard they want to come in and take you out on a date. Um, but I heard they know some horrible things, uh, horrible wrongdoings were done to you in the past. And they know you ask a lot of questions and you don't take no crap, basically. Um, so they haven't made a decision. So that's the two of wands energy and decision energy here. They haven't made a decision as far as inviting you out on a date. Uh, obviously, they're interested in you romantically. Um However that resonates, but I heard they're also narcissistic. So hopefully you can get this message. If this message, particular message applies to you, Leo Feminine, I feel you were single, single as a Pringle. Definitely single as a Pringle energy, but there's a very narcissistic Aries after this Leo, Leo Feminine. This earth sign knows this. Okay, so, okay, Leo Fem. Okay, so I heard there's a very um, narcissistic Aries after you, uh, after you. So I don't know if they're after you to harm you or after you for some other reason. Um, it doesn't sound pleasant. I'll tell you that um, this narcissistic Aries after you doesn't sound pleasant in some shape. It just doesn't sound pleasant. I'll tell you that. Um, but this other son knows this Aries, but um, this Aries is after you. Um, I feel stalking, stalking, lurking, or something like that energy. I didn't hear any of that, but I kind of feel that. They're after you, so I feel they, they're they like stalking you, lurking you. And I don't feel good intentions here from either one of these people, to be honest with you, from either one. This Aries, they have Aries in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, Moon, Hammer, Jupiter, or this Earth sign that lives in your community. Now, whether the Earth, uh, Aries lives in your community or not, I'm not sure. But there is an Aries, heavily, I feel after you so i feel stalking or lurking energy 
narcissistic Aries and a narcissistic Earth sign. They're both narcissistic. Um, so I heard it wouldn't be smart. Um, it'd be smart to steer away from these people. Um, this person wants to ask you out on a date. And then you have this narcissistic Aries after you too. So the narcissistic Aries for some of you guys could be an ex um husband ex-wife ex-spouse uh, well ex-spouse ex-husband ex-wife ex-baby mama ex-baby well ex baby mama baby daddy ex-girlfriend ex-boyfriend you could have been in a relationship with them is what i'm trying to say or it could have just been somebody that wanted to be in a relationship with you or somebody that is mentally unstable and they want to harm you but somehow they're after you in some shape form or fashion um and they're narcissistic so it'd be and you can take the advice or leave it, but I would steer away from the Aries and I would steer away from this earth sign that wants to take you out on a date. This earth sign knew some horrible root wrongdoings were done to you. They knew it, but had they told you? No, but they know about it. They know about it because maybe they were part of the ones that helped do the wrongdoings to you. I feel for some of these earth signs, they are part of the wrongdoings. They, I think they helped do the wrongdoings to you. It's exactly what I think. Um, and I feel... You, Leo Finn, you're pulling up as the Empress Upright energy here. So this earth sign, masculine, Taurus Capricorn, masculine, you interact with this person in some shape, form, or fashion, or you either interact with them, or they are on your social media in some shape, form, or fashion, and they, like, look at your material on social media, whatever social media platform that is. Possibly. I didn't hear that was the case, but... Somehow they're interested in you to ask you out on a date is what I'm saying. So you either interact with them in the 3D or they're viewing you in some shape, form, or fashion. I'm feeling social media wise. Um, you plug it in how it resonates, but you're pulling in as the Empress, um, which is the bomb.com energy. We all know that. So you're, I mean, whatever you're doing, you keep doing it. You keep being the Empress. You're very giving, loving, kind to the universe. Um, I heard you don't take no crap, but empresses don't take no crap because you don't get to the empress energy by not living and learning. And that's just the damn truth. So I, you don't take no crap. I heard you ask a lot of questions and I think it would make this earth sign uncomfortable because I think they were part of, um, trying to take your ass down in the past, Wh whatever these horrible wrongdoings were. Several shocking series of chain events are going to occur with this situation soon. Someone is about to start looking into this very, very, very heavy investigation for the horrible wrongdoings of the past. It's about to shock the hell out of this earth sign. Okay, I heard several shocking series of chain events are going to occur with this. Someone's about to uh, start looking into these horrible wrongdoings of the past to you, Empress Leo Fem. If this resonates for you, I'm... Um, and I heard it's going to shock the hell out of this earth sign. So this earth sign that wants, that has not made a decision on what to ask you about on date, I heard it's going to shock the hell out of them. Um, they're coming in as a knight too. I just want to say, you're coming in as a freaking empress, Leo Femme. They're coming in as a knight. Um, a knight, not even a king. Uh, so y'all aren't even compatible energetically. I feel they're immature. They could be 18 to 25 because that's the age range for night energy. But, you know, it doesn't have to be an 18 to 25 year old. It could be a freaking 35 year old that acts like an 18 year old. Just saying. Um, but they're, I feel they're immature. I feel they're immature. Maybe they don't make good decisions with their money. Maybe they don't make good decisions, in, um, period. But it's like player energy. Player in and out, immature energy. The night energy is. I feel it's a masculine energy or a femme that takes on heavy masculine. You plug it in how it resonates. And obviously, they, I mean, they participate, I feel.